everyone, welcome back at Amsterdam Insight. We're here with another interview today. Um, today we are here with Jefferson Agume. What's up, bro? Everything good, bro. You? Yeah, good. I'm good, man. Very. Uh, thank you if you're here. Yeah, thank you for your time. Um, today we're gonna discuss. Gonna do 15 questions. Yes, uh, about his lifestyle, career, and also some questions from the fans, of course. Um, starting with your lifestyle. Yes. So we're gonna get right into it. Um, of course, you have a passion for football, but uh, we would also like to know what your passion is besides the field and besides football. Besides the or field, hobbies I, or anything like, like that. Like hobbies are like, uh, you know, Japanese animation movie. Yeah, like the anime yeah, stuff. Like yeah, anime. so I watch a lot of anime. Yeah, when really? I, yeah, when I'm at home alone, I used to watch it and uh, I love this since... Uh, what show? What kind of anime? Every, everything I watch, uh, you know, Naruto, One, oh, yeah, One yeah. Piece, yeah, exactly. you know, uh, Demon Slayer, yeah, everything. Yeah, yeah, we know all of them, we know all of them. Yeah. Great, bro. Good to hear that. Then, of course, important food. Yeah. Yes, very important in life. What's your favorite cuisine and why? My favorite cuisine, I think, is uh, Italian cuisine, you know. Italian, okay. Yeah, I play for, for Inter, Inter, Inter yes. Milan, so when I, I went to Italy, I I eat, I had uh, very good there and uh, I love Italian food like pizza, pasta. Yeah, man. Yeah. Okay. You also, you also eat a lot here, like when you were at the, at the club as well. Yeah, you yeah, get a lot yeah, of pasta yeah. as well. Yeah, yeah. A lot right. of pasta, pizza. In Italia, we, we eat good, though. Yeah. yeah. They have a good good food cuisine. Yeah. yeah, really good. All right, and of course, well, we can say that you value your style a little bit because you've also bought some stuff from us as well, in, yeah. uh, in clothes and accessories. Um, so we're wondering what your favorite clothing style or brand is. My f my favorite brand, I think, uh, that's uh, Gior and uh, Louis Vuitton. Gior and Louis Vuitton. Because I, I have yes. uh, some stuff from, from them. If, if not, uh, I like to wear everything like Prada, you know. Yeah. Sometimes you have to, to have different styles. Yes, actually. So switch uh, it up a little yeah, bit. Switch it up. Yes. Like Balenciaga sometimes. Right and, now, uh, good fit, bro. Casablanca. Dior, you know? Balenciaga. Yeah. yeah. So you have to to switch. Sometimes not always the same. Exactly. But, uh, you have to be different. Yeah, be, be different. Be, be original. Yeah. That's important. Yeah. It is. Get your own style. Yeah. 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 All right. And while well, you're going on a holiday, yeah. yes, um, Dubai, yeah. but we want really to know, like, what's your holiday destination that's still on your bucket list that you haven't been to yet and that no. you're not going to right now? <laughs> of course. Uh, no, I, I have, a, I have a many, many uh, holidays, places that I, I want to, to go, so I, I don't know. Mm, um, name maybe two. Maybe two, but uh, right now I'm going to to Dubai. Yes. But uh, I like uh, you know some uh, islands. Oh yeah, okay. like a, uh, some kind yeah, of island. Doesn't really matter what. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, cool. The sun, the beach. Yes. Uh, relaxation. Yeah, relaxation. All right. Maybe, I don't know Maldives, you know. Yeah, like the Maldives. Yeah. Very nice, man. Well, we can look up with that as well if you want. Next summer. Maybe. Yeah, next summer. Yeah. All right, um, then uh, last question for your lifestyle. Very important to know what you can live without. Five items you can yeah. live without. Jefferson, I think, um, Lucien Jefferson yeah. Agumi. You can live without no, five I, items. The first one I think is my phone. Because, your phone? Uh, yeah. Okay. I, or, always with my all phone. your contacts, yeah, everything. All my contacts, in there. everything. Yeah. And after. Uh, my PlayStation. Ah, yeah. You took, you took it with you now, or? No, you got three back, man. No, no, because, <laughs> because the, there wasn't uh, so so much space in my bag, but uh, I have mm. always I play like uh, five five hours uh, a day. Really? Yeah, FIFA, you know. FIFA, ah, yeah, yeah. Everything, so yeah. My, you play with other teammates as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My uh, my PlayStation after. Mm. Three more to go, bro. Yeah, I, I don't know. <laughs> Only your phone and your PlayStation. Yeah, That's phone awesome. and PlayStation. The the most one I yes. I used to, to use is my phone is on, and my PlayStation. 
After I don't know anymore. Just basic necessities yeah. as well, you know. Yeah, stuff like Sometimes that. Sometimes yeah. I'm, I'm uh, at home. I, I watch TV. Uh -huh. Don't know. Some Netflix as well. Yeah, Netflix. Uh -huh. You know, some uh, movies. Yes. Japanese. Uh, Japanese anime. anime. Yes. Yeah. All right. Just right, chilling. Man. Just chilling, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very good. All right. Well, those were the questions about his lifestyle. Mm -hmm. Let's move on to your career questions. Mm -hmm. Yes. Um, these are getting a bit more serious. Yes, just mm -hmm. another day. Yeah. Um, the first one. Yes. Um, you of course have some goals and ambitions, or you had some goals and ambitions. Yeah. Um, be before you started your career, or before you became a professional footballer, you wanted to become a professional yeah, footballer. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Uh, but now, I assume you must have goals and ambitions still. Yeah. So we would like to know what are like some goals and ambitions yeah. you have, like inside the pitch or and off uh, off the pitch as well. No, off the pitch, I think I just want to to be a good guy with my family, my friends, yeah. with everyone. It's exactly. It's important to be a, exactly. a good it's guy. Exactly. It's very important. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah, it's just uh, off the pitch. I just, I just uh, want to be a good guy. And on the pitch, you know, when you play football, you always want to to play on the biggest stage, mm. like uh, Champions League, yeah. national teams. Exactly. So that's uh, that's my goal. That's your goal. Yeah. Goals for now yeah. to get the Champions League, get to the national team. Yes, get yeah. more playing time. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I I hope one day it's gonna be possible. So I work. Yeah. Uh, I work every day for, for that, so... Yeah, let's very see. good, man. Let's see, let's see. I think if you keep working every day, we'll be all right, man. For sure. Um, then, uh, a bit of a more negative question. <laughs> What's been the worst moment so far in your career? Can the, you name it? The worst moment of my career for now has been uh, when we lost the semi-final of uh, the World Cup Under-17 mm. in Brazil. Yeah, the we, against uh, yeah against Brazil. We, against Brazil. Yeah, we lost uh, three two, but we we were winning two two zero at uh, at the half time. Oh no way! So in the second half, we we take three goals and we lost the semi final. That's uh, for for now. That's uh, the worst moment for yeah. in my career. Yeah, I understand. I play for myself as well, and I feel the pain, man. Yeah. I feel the pain. It's it's really fucked up. All right. Well, apart from the worst moment, you also have a game, yeah. maybe like one game in your career that has stuck in your head or has stayed in your head the most. Yeah, the first, you remember the first one, you know, the yeah, first, the first one. Uh, All right. the first why? Why is that? Yeah, because you know you you work from a, from a young age yeah, from to be yeah nothing, yeah so. to be a professional footballer. So the first game is. Uh, First, is professional yeah, game of first professional game is important. That's uh, for now. That's the the most important for me. The first, my first professional game and my first uh, Serie A game with uh, Inter. Yeah. That's the two. That's the two yeah, most, two most important. Most. Yeah, I understand that. Then positive note. What's been your best moment so far? No, Besides your debuts, maybe, but. Yeah, besides my debuts, is uh, when I sang, I sang for uh, for Hinta, you know, it's yeah. a big, it's big, club. big moment. Yeah, big, big club for me and my family. Yeah, a lot of international players, yeah. a lot of like it's international, a, well, well known internationally. Yeah, so, yeah. that was a, a proud moment for me and my family. You know, you, so I start uh, in the in a little city, yeah. little uh, little team. Yeah. After when you sang to. Uh, Inter Milan is a is a huge moment for you and your family. So, so if you start from there, yeah, and you go to such a big club, it's mm. like really good feeling. Yeah. Yeah. That was a, a good moment for me. All right, and then last question for your career um, about your career uh, we have is um, for what club or competition would you like to have played or still play in your career? And why? So for like mm -hmm. in what competition or what club in the world? Yeah. You still feel like okay, because you know you already played Inter. Yeah. It's a very good club, very internationally. No, for me, yeah. For me play at Inter for me. Yeah. Is That's the, already is like my main goal for me now. Yeah. My main goal is to is play for Inter. Yeah, but is there if like is there one club in your mind 
that you're like, oh yeah, from childhood, like from my childhood dream club, yeah. was this club? Mm. I don't know, I don't know. So, you know, you just wanted I to used play to watch football, football and yeah. uh, I don't have a favorite team. So no. now uh, I sign for, for Inter. No, uh, Inter is your favorite goal team. Is, uh, play for yeah. Inter Milan. You know, exactly. You know, it's, a big, it's a big club, you won uh, Serie A last year. Yeah, so my exactly. Main, uh, my main goal is uh, to play for Inter. Yes, yeah, so to get into the starting lineup. Yeah, yeah. exactly, man. All right, very good. Very good. Forza Inter. So yeah, Inter Forza Inter. Yes. Yeah. All right. Those were the questions about his lifestyle and his career. Then we also have five more questions from the fans. Yes, yeah. and I'll get my phone for that because it's on my phone. Um, let me see. All right, question number one. Yes. What's your favorite music for in the dressing room? Yeah, I'm the I'm the DJ. In, uh, you are the DJ. Yeah, I'm the DJ. In, uh, okay. So I have to play every every style of music. Every you know, style. Because we have uh, some uh, old players. Oh, young, young players. players. So have you have to, a, you have like a, a playlist yeah, with a lot of mixes in yeah, it. Yeah, a lot of okay. mixes. Tell you me. Know, I uh, can I can put Lil Baby, Lil Dirk. Yeah, the yeah, song yeah. Uh, the song after I can Ed Sheeran. You know. Oh so, shit! So, it's very really different. So I have to, yeah. I have to uh, to mix because you have uh, old players, young players. We don't have the same, uh, the same age. Well, the same age groups. Same, group age same, yeah. uh, same taste. Same taste of music. So yeah. I have to to put everything on my uh, on my playlist. Yeah. Wow. Okay, you're the DJ. Good yeah. to know. Good to know. Then, um, who's your idol in football? My who's idol? your idol? Who do you look up to? When I was. Uh, Younger, I used to watch uh, videos of uh, Ronaldinho, you know. Ronaldinho. Growing up, Ronaldinho yes. was. Uh, I never, I, I never watched him play the. No, the, I also never watched him play like real life. Yeah, life, mm -hmm. but, life. Uh, yeah. I watched so many uh, videos. Yeah. And, uh, was my uh, one of my uh, my best players. Yeah, one of the inspirations, yeah. you know. Yeah. But uh, you know, growing up, you. You start to to analyze, mm. to watch more. Yeah. So I, I don't know who is my my favorite player. Favorite player, my, but uh, one of the others at least. Just oh. I I love to inspire me from uh, the the best players in my position, you know. So mm. I don't I don't have one uh, one, one player specifically. Mm. Yeah. You pick a lot of players yeah, who are good in your position. If I, if I can learn from one player, I, I learned that. From an, another one, I learned, I'm going to learn uh, everything, uh, uh, anything else. So Yeah, I that's good, man. Learn from a lot yeah, of people. Yeah, yeah. yeah. From, exactly. Learn from a lot of players. You will learn the most. Then, uh, question number three. Um, when did you know that you wanted to become a professional football player? Since uh, since young, you know, when, really when young. I, yeah, when I start play play football in my for the city. first time on the field, yeah. you know, age eight, the, seven, the, six. I think yeah. every uh, every kid who uh, who play football, yeah. the goal is to become a professional exactly. footballer. So yeah. I always wanted to be a, mm -hmm. a professional footballer. Yeah, man, clear, yeah. clear. Then question number four: Do you rather score a goal or assist a teammate? Assist. I'm assist? assist? Yeah, assist, man. Oh, wow. Yeah. Why is that? Hmm? Why is that? I don't know. For me, it's the same. The the assist is uh, as important as the goal. True. Because uh, if... Uh, without the assist, you can't score. Assist, uh, you, mm. you can't score, so... But I rather assist uh, my, my partner than uh, score goals. Good. That's the first one we had so far. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone wants to score goals. <laughs> Um, number five, yes, last one. Um, I'm actually curious about this one as well. Yeah. Uh, if you weren't a professional football player, what would your career be? So, if you were a professional football yeah, player, I, I don't, don't know. Bro. You don't know? Yeah, I don't know. Because that's like I every time know, we ask this I, question, I, I, like we ask it one more time, everything. like huh? another player as well, and you're also like, oh, I don't know, I just want to become no. a player. I put everything in football, you know. Yeah. I don't know. I was good uh, at school, huh? but uh, I always wanted to be a professional footballer, you know? Yeah. And, uh, even at school. Even at school, yeah, on, on, on the playground. The teacher, the, the, yeah. I always said to the teacher, you, you're going to say I'm going to be a professional footballer one day, so yeah. I always wanted to be, to be that. Uh, and, well, you manifested uh, it. Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah. Major dreams come true yeah, so far. Dream, yeah, for, so, for sure. That's good, that man. That was uh, my biggest dream. Yeah. And uh, I'm, I'm living, uh, living my dream now. So exactly. And you're still living on the yeah. dream, you know, and getting better and better yeah, every day. Better. Yeah. yeah. I'm still young, so. Exactly. We'll see what uh, the future. We'll see what the future holds. Oh. Yes, exactly. Well, so thank you for the interview. Yes, thank you very much. Um, yes, thank you very much. And um, for, uh, of course, the things you got, if you want to see those, you can look at our Instagram, follow our page. Um, also, subscribe to our YouTube channel. It's going to be a lot of interviews in the, in the future soon. I'm Slick Insight. This was Mitchell. This was Lucien Agume. We're out. Peace.